CMU researchers provide novel insights on potential target site of T-cells, to be used for cancer immunotherapy development. The World Health Organization reported that cancer is responsible for approximately 9.6 million deaths globally in 2018 alone, making it the second leading cause of death. Conventionally, cancer treatments have almost always been associated with chemotherapy, and its harsh post-treatment side effects on the patients. Upcoming treatments like immunotherapy, are exploring our immune system's natural army of defense, T-cells and B-cells, to improve anti-tumor immune responses. Likewise, Professor Min Chie Hung and his team, by understanding the significance of programmed cell death protein 1, PD-1, structure in T-cells, synthesized an antibody, STM-418 to improve the efficacy of immunotherapy. When tested on lab mice, STM-418 displayed better anti-tumor immunity, compared to the existing FDA-approved nivolumab and pembrolizumab PD-1 antibodies. Leveraging on the PD-1 glycosylation and N58 in T-cells, STM-418 proved higher binding affinity to PD-1 and successful inhibition of PD-1 interaction with PD-L1 ligand. Thus, increasing the effectiveness of T-cells in anti-tumor immune responses. This promising therapeutic blockade of tumor progression serves as a remarkable breakthrough in immunotherapy and could be used as reference for future anti-cancer research. As envisioned in United Nations SDG 3, Good Health and Well-Being, the findings of this study could lay foundation for future research and better the chances of battling cancer.